Hey guys, what's up? It's your friendly neighborhood because here back again with another Slave the Spire video. I believe the daily is still on yesterday's. Sure is. Where did I end up? Top 4,000. I'll, I'll fucking, I'll take it. I will take it. And you know what? I've been having so much success as Ironclad lately, uh, you know, given that I beat one single ascension run as well as two dailies. So uh, with that being said, we're playing some Ironclad here. So I can remove a card, I can gain max HP, or I can gain gold at the cost of a curse, or of course I could give up the classic of uh, burning blood traded in for probably just pure garbage. Um, these are pretty interesting choices. I could go for curse gold, and if the curse ends up being not bad, or we see Doohoo doll here, um, then we could, you know, just spend that gold to buy a whole ton of stuff. Which does sound kind of sweet. Um, and worst case scenario... Okay, that's that's a pretty bad curse. Worst case scenario, we get a bad curse, as you can see. Uh, and then we end up... Um, yeah, we can, we can do this. Obviously, like, this six is kind of irrelevant. I would have preferred, potentially, to... You know, not take it at all. Because you don't... You, you start at less health uh, in Ascension or whatever. So, um... Alright, I'm gonna take uh, an early pummel. Duvu doll! Fuck. Uh, there's a blue candle, though, which is an interesting idea for sure. Hmm. We got choices. This this shop isn't the best of all time. Now, I, c I could also pay 100 for 4 max HP, or 311 for 14. Obviously, this is better max HP per gold spent uh, when you compare the two um, but I might not want to spend 311 on that so I, I could take blue candle and remove normality even though I have blue candle I could just remove normality I think I'm removing normality almost no matter what and I think Metrioshka Metri Met Met that's the one uh, I think I think that might be good enough so it's kind of like buying two chest relics for the future, right? Because we're guaranteed to get two chests before this run ends. In fact, we're guaranteed three chests. So that could be pretty good. The only other thing I'm considering really is bludgeon. And I can't get bludgeon and that, so it's a tough call. Um, it's possible bludgeon's just not good enough anyway. So I'll just take the doll. And we'll go from there. Mmm. 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 Alright, let's see what we hit. Dropkick. Sure. That's actually great. Ended up being enough to not take any damage. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna block here. Take three. I do kind of want to preserve my health a bit. So that's 12 plus 18 is, is very much lethal. Uh, Thunderclap is pretty good. I will take it. I think they need to buff Sever Soul, to be completely honest with you. I mean, maybe I'm the wrong one, but I, I believe that Sever Soul tends to be pretty awful. Costing two and not necessarily having the, like, big impact right away, it's pretty, pretty bad. Alright, well, I'm just running out the defense plus that. Unfortunately, I am going to take five here. As long as I don't take much more, it'll be fine. I could double strike this louse and just take zero. I think that's just what I'm going to do. And then dealing six shouldn't be too terribly difficult. There you go. I will take a battle trance. The first one's quite good. Beyond that, not so good. But the first one, like I said, quite good. So I'll take it. I think I'm also going to upgrade pummel. It's the least increase, or er, the lowest increase in damage for a single card. Uh, but as soon as we get any amount of strength, which is relatively easy to get. So that's 15 plus 9. Okay. So we could get Spike Slime to 1 if we want. I don't really want, though, to be frank. Yeah, let's just hit the Jawworm and then block. Take 7 down to 67. That's not too bad. Cool. Jawworm's not a... or uh, rather, Spike Slime not attacking again. Unfortunately, we're going to take 4 here. Uh, is Bash better than Double Strike? I believe it is. Honestly, I could just Bash Strike. This, like... It's probably already guaranteed that he's dead on this following turn. 
I mean, we just need three attacks. And that's one of them. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Just take him out. And take the 10. I probably played that fight pretty poorly, to be honest, but... I don't think it's gonna be a huge issue. Worst case scenario, I lose out on one upgrade and have to rest coming up, but... I don't think it'll be that bad. I'll take an Inflame. It's early enough that I'm pretty happy with it, and in fact, I think I'm just gonna upgrade it. Right away. Whetstone and Bottled Flame. I like that. Um, are we gonna bottle something? Probably Thunderclap, if anything, right? Or Bash. Let's go Thunderclap. I would have loved to bottle... Ooh. Yeah, remove a card. Um, let's get rid of a strike. I would have loved to bottle Bash, but I don't think that that would have been quite correct. Because if we don't actually get any plus energy stuff, uh, it would be awful. <laughs> Alright, not the best first turn, but it'll do. I'm going to go with a Bash and a Strike. And this one, I'm going to pop this here Artifact Potion. Because he's going to be volning us on that turn. And I would rather not take infinity fucking damage. Not a thing I tend to enjoy. Apparently it didn't matter. But hey, uh, flex obviously is the pickup. And we, we got some good shit going on. We have got some good shit. Doesn't quite kill you. So if that doesn't quite kill you, I guess I kill the guy who's going to cause some blocking. I could work on the Gremlin Wizard, but I think we should be fine in the long run on the Gremlin Wizard. Uh, I could just kill him now. No, I think we'll just kill this guy. Like, we're not guaranteed to... Actually, we are totally guaranteed to kill him now that I looked at these cards for a moment. Because this is 15 plus strike. Sorry, that's 25. My math is somehow incredibly incorrect. <laughs> like, that might have been the most incorrect I could have possibly been. Alright. Pump up the flex. Ooh. I can't Thunderclap into Bash because of the Inflame, but I think setting up the Inflame is going to be more important than the Voln on that turn. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to go full offense. We can probably race him. It shouldn't be too bad. Battle Trance. No Flex, huh? Alright. So this... Hopefully we get Flex plus both our... Yeah, we did. Plus, both our Vulns sets up quite well. Okay. Uh, I think I'm... Mm, I'm not sure if I want to take six here. <laughs> I kind of do. I kind of just want to take it. But I think it's correct not to take it. Okay. One of them. One of these. And I could defend. Defend versus 13. I think 13 is going to be a little bit better. I mean, we have to block this turn or we die. Um, or kill him. But it looks like we're blocking. I could just full block here. Uh, this 15. Yeah, let's just full block here. Take one down to 11. This gives us more turns to work with. And we got there. Thank God. <laughs> I was actually, like, pretty close, to be honest with you. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna snap up this offering. Fiendfire could be cute, but obviously, offering is still offering. And as... More or less anticipated, we did not get any energy relics. So I'm going to take Tiny House instead of the other two. I think Tiny House is probably the best of the three. And... Ooh. Eh. I don't know about this. <laughs> I don't know about these. Hemokinesis is pretty strong. But it has no synergy with our current deck. I think I'm going to skip those. We have no self-damage synergy yet, which is one of the key th the key reasons that I wasn't really keen on picking up either of the two things that self-damage. Um, I like Left Path. Even though it forces us into two elites, uh, it actually looks really, really good. Alright, sweet. Offering. This guy. This guy. That guy. That guy. And may as well get some block out there. Probably not gonna get through this block too quick, huh? Yeah, alright, we'll do this. Unfortunately, we missed on the flex. Which means we are not actually... Oh no, we are totally are killing him. Never mind, I'm a liar. But I'm also a really good at video games liar. I'm actually going to take Rage here. I think that's going to be good. Take a random relic. Magic Flower is great. 
get double shop if we desire. Um, I don't think Second Rage is good enough. I don't think this is a feel no pain kind of deck. And because we have another shop coming up right away, I'm actually not going to do anything yet. Because we can't, we don't have enough to remove and then remove, right? We have enough for one remove period. That's it, right? So, yeah, I, I'd rather see what this shop has to offer rather than waste my money first. Um, and this shop actually has a pretty good card to offer. I'm pretty down for the Heavy Blade, but I think it might be correct just to remove a card. Because the deck currently has, has eh, it's a little lopsided. So I think, yeah, I think I'm going to remove a strike. Obviously, I couldn't have afforded the Vajra. I would have loved to, but it's not able. That's pretty good. Okay, this is ridiculous, actually. So that one, plus that one, plus this one, and that one. And it's not lethal, but we took zero, and he's vulnerable, and he's dead to literally any draws. Ain't that great? And we healed nine. I love it. I love it. There. Yep. Upgrade the offering. That seems pretty easy. Got, ooh, a pretty rough elite fight on average. Hopefully we can make this work. Immolate is incredible here. Okay, that's actually fucking bananas. <laughs> Jesus. Alright, so I'm gonna pop this just so I can take out two of them. I'm a liar because it gives you... <laughs> it gives one energy on ascension. We do- our potions are weaker now, alright? Okay? <laughs> potions suck now, alright? Fucking learn it, Jesus! <laughs> alright, Twin Strike is fine. I'm gonna go this way. I... Eh. I add two cards to the deck, it goes to 20? Nah. Bite is- uh, the bites are pretty good with Magic Flower. Like, don't, don't get me wrong, right? I would not fault anybody for making that choice. Um, ooh. Eh, it only upgrades five cards. Yeah, let's just remove basic strike. That's fine. Um, but I think what I did is probably correct. Probably. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm wrong. This turn is going to be absurd. This turn is already fucking absurd. Jesus. That draws four. So I gotta, I gotta run something out. Um, alright, we'll just, we'll run that out, obviously, then Battle Trance, yeah, then Flex, we can Pummel him, we can Sword Boom him, and then he's fucking dead. The man is deceased. It's not really a man, though. Second Flex could take Shrug, uh, I'll just take the second Flex, I think that's fine. More question marks, because I love him, please no, okay. Okay. Sure. Yeah, I'm actually pretty down with that. This one would be fine as well. Okay. It's fine. I actually quite like that addition. I do think Headbutt's pretty good in this kind of deck. Unsurprisingly. Upgrade the other Flex. And now we got Mr. Baus. Uh, yeah, put Thunderclap on top. Because then we can get the Thunderclap on these dudes. Yeah, and we can have a very good turn, actually. Maybe not, like, very good, but, like, pretty good, <laughs> to be fair. Uh, we are gonna take a nine. It's not too bad. Yep, he took Offering. I don't like it. In fact, I would I would argue that I fucking hate it. Uh, we can't quite kill him, but we get him real close, and then next turn we kill him with a Twin Strike, and we get our Offering back with a Battle Trance, and hopefully we have just an absurd turn, right? Oh, fuck yeah, bud. Alright, kill ya. Offering first, obviously. Ooh, beautiful. Okay. Then a battle trance. Uh, you have not stolen anything yet. And what would we want to headbutt on top? Probably either rage or flex. Actually, you know what? Probably battle trance. So let's get that on top. Um, let's kill this orb. How are we killing? <sighs> yeah, this is fine. All right. Battle trance on top, right? And then I want to strike you. And then I want to pummel ya. And then take some. Nine. Not too bad. Alright, so let's run that out. Then this. Redraw flex like a god. Yeah, and just play all the multi-hits. Best we got. So now I can weaken the hyper beam in the event that we don't actually, you know, do well enough to survive. 
Let's again put Battle Trance on top. So, I'm technically alive, so I can save this potion. Hopefully we kill him pretty quick. I think we got him. <laughs> um, I guess, again, Battle Trance on top forever. Alright, well, he's at one. I mean, I'm not dead, and he is, so... There you go. A little risky. A little bit. But I think I'm pretty down. Pretty happy with the way this is going. Uh, I don't know about these. I'd be pretty down to take the demon form if, and only if, I had already picked up a uh, an energy relic. Now, you could argue that it's like fairly likely to pick up an energy relic on this one. It might even be like guaranteed. I don't know how many non-energy boss relics exist in the game. Um, but... I'm not sold on demon form. And I don't think I want bludgeon either. I think I'm skipping. Okay, so there's runic dome. Runic cube could also be fine. But uh, currently we have battle trance in the deck. So it could cause some amount of issues. Realistically it wouldn't though. Because the only thing that really triggers that we do is offering. Uh, and we're obviously not going to offering after a battle trance. Well, unless it, like, kills the boss, you know? <laughs> unless it just kills whatever we're fighting right away. Okay, so, obviously, the current shop positions... There's only two shops? That's awful. Um, so we're either just not going to a shop or going to this shop and having a mediocre route. Actually, it's a pretty good route, to be honest. All right, let's go this way. Mediocre is definitely not the correct word. <laughs> Alright, take, like, yeah, one. Basically zero. Uh, I mean, you're dead. We get to heal nine. Ooh, I love it. I guess, should I wait until we get... Because I think that'll actually heal us. Uh, yeah, I'll take shrug. Because we can use the outside of combat now. That's, like, one of the things that they changed. I don't really want any of this. <laughs> um, I could just remove a card. I'm not sure exactly what I would be removing. Honestly, maybe a defend at this point. Yeah, that seems honestly fine. I don't think I want to buy anything either, so... Eh, let this money go to waste. So I think popping this, it should put us to... Uh, my math skills are horrific. 87? That is indeed correct. Okay, cool. That's pretty good. Uh, and I guess 13 times 2. Alright, so we have to target the same one with both if we want to kill them. Could also just not kill them, though. That is viable, I would say. Just prep two of them. Yeah, okay. I shouldn't take much damage, if any, here. Okay, cool, I take zero. Great. If they were all three attacking, I would have taken a little bit. Just a little bit, though. Not too much. So this is 15, and this is 13. Okay. I mean, it's probably fine to just kill both these and set up a little bit of block. Take some damage. Eight. It's not too bad. Pretty guaranteed to kill this, huh? <laughs> Feels that way, at least. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> very, very lethal. Very incredibly fucking lethal. Like, I'm, I'm so tempted by Rupture, but again, we don't actually have anything. If I took that Hemokinesis earlier, I'd be way more down for it. I hate this, but I guess I have to ditch Pummel. Inflame is, like, pretty relevant. Obviously, I'm not losing Offering, so... I think Pummel is slightly less relevant than Inflame. Could be wrong. You know what, let's go the full three. See what we get. Maybe Madness. M -m probably Finesse, if anything. And Master Strategy is good. Shh. Sure, I'll take Finesse, and do I even want Madness? Uh, I don't know, it's not its not bad. But we can't realistically hit things very consistently. I think I'm going to skip. I think I'm fine with skipping there. Let's run this block out and put that back on top, I think. Because we can't do a lot of damage on this turn, because of the intangible. So I'd rather just draw blocking. 
effects. Right, I will run this out, even though that seems really awkward. I think this will end up being good enough, though. Cool, only took six, I love it. All right, this is the turn where we gotta, oh fuck, we gotta, we gotta turn up the jets. Although I will say, I think we're turning up the fucking jets here. Holy fuck. <laughs> Holy fuck! I mean, yeah, whatever. Just get two block. It doesn't really matter. All right, so that's that's a card. Then this is also a card. That is also a card. Sing Bull's great. Regen's incredible. I think I'm just gonna go max HP. Go this way. Okay. Sweet. No attack is perfect. Yep. Start with an offering for sure. Give it a finesse. We got, we got too much shit in our hand. I don't know what to do with all of this shit. <laughs> it's, it's too much. <laughs> it's, it's too much. Um, I guess... <laughs> What's the order we want to do? Actually, you know what? Alright, Headbutt, Flex, Battle Trance, Easy Game, another one of these. Sure, whatever. Whatever, who, who fucking cares, man? <laughs> Very incredibly lethal. Has been acquired. Uh, Dropkick's cute, but not necessary. Deck is great. I pretty much just need to actually execute, and we should be good to go. Alright, don't hit Spiker a lot. Fine by me. Probably taking, like... Okay, cool. Took zero. Perfect. It's like it was planned or something. Okay. <laughs> sure. And that'll draw perfect. Oh, poor master of strategy. Okay. Uh, well, we can kill somebody here. That's for sure. 60. 24 plus 16. It's going to be 40. Hmm. Then I, I... I mean, we can kill the spirit guardian. Costs... Well, how about this? 16, 16, 16? It's not enough. Uh... Hmm. I guess we do just throw all of our... Yeah, alright. I think the Sphere Guardian is relevant enough that I want to just fucking kill him. And our bottom card is Rage, which is fine. We can flex back on top. Do that. Say go. Hopefully not take much, if any. Sweet, took zero. I love it. Beautiful redraw of Master of Strategy. Plus that guy. Okay, that's... Probably should have shrugged. <laughs> oh well. Alright, so this one. And I guess... Yeah, I guess I run out defending than that. Beautiful, look at that shit. It's like I know what I'm doing. Could take dual wield. That's actually... Eh, it's probably not that good. Dual wielding in flames, though, does sound quite good. But, and I don't think I want a third flex. I think a third flex will clog up too much. Alright, let's try out the dual wield. You know, if this ends up getting me killed, it ends up getting me killed. and I'm not gonna... complain about it. I haven't used dual wield with powers in so fucking long. Nice, dude. The one heal. <laughs> Perfect. Um, so we could upgrade this guy. Could upgrade that guy. It's probably just the cards. Like, upgrade the shit that draws more, right? I'm going to go this way because we get two more upgrades. Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> what the fuck do I do here, dude? I don't even know how to do this. I don't even know what to do here. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm gonna dual wield Thunderclap. I think that's step one. I think step two is literally just Thunderclap into Thunderclap into Thunderclap. And step three is Master of Strategy. Hit Flex, Finesse, Rage, sure why not, right? And then play one more card into Battle Trance. Uh, this one scales worse than the alternatives actually get flex on top look at this shit he's doing what he knows how to do and then run this out and then we'll just run this out for approximately a million yeah okay cool turn one and full hp i like it <laughs> all right cool <laughs> i mean i could have done the math right against three block that gains two block i guess we'll just upgrade the finesse first I probably could have fought bonus elites, but I don't like fighting bonus elites. They scare me. They make me feel incredibly uncomfortable. Beautiful. I like the first turn attack. That's that's perfect to me. Maybe that wasn't the correct first play. 
In fact, I'm, I'm fairly certain that was not the correct first play. All right, what do we want to do then? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm going to start with a headbutt. We're going to get flex on top. I'm going to dual wield in flames, and we're going to run out in flame, and then in flame, and then we're going to run out in flame. All right, and I only have one energy left, and that's fine. Uh, because he shouldn't be attacking on this turn. He should be debuffing. That's the most likely occurrence. Now, I could run out Master Strategy, but I don't believe that's correct. Although, to be fair, my next turn's not looking too good. So maybe I do run this out, but what am I drawing into? I mean, two flexes are pretty probable here. And then Battle Trance. So guaranteed. And then, run this out. It's only 80. <laughs> what a shame. I think that's fine, though. Gives me some block if he does end up attacking. He did not. Great. This is a pretty awful turn. Uh, we should take some damage here. Nine. That's actually fine. Nine is still covered for, with our uh, with our insurance, I guess. <laughs> there you go. Block potion's great. Just gonna go max HP. And then I'll get our final upgrade here. Uh, more damage, more damage, or just more block. I think the more block is gonna be better. Could be wrong. I guess I'm kicking it off with a battle trance, which kind of sucks a little bit. This I like, though. Actually, this is great. So the question is, do I run out the third thunderclap or bash the guy I'm trying to kill first? I think I bash the guy I'm trying to kill first weaken the guy who's attacking me and maybe even pop the block potion and then say go beautiful only eight damage can't dual wield that obviously but that's okay get the get the 24 out there take a little bit more damage now we can run this guy out get some bonus healing I love it Let's run that mess Ooh, that's actually way better than what I was thinking. I, for some reason, forgot that that, you know, <laughs> the, the final card would be guaranteed. I don't know how I forgot, but I did. Okay, take some damage. Not too much. Okay, it was a bit more than I thought. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, I guess I guess you headbutt back, dude. Get the flex back. Probably do this, probably do that, probably do this. Say go. Take a bunch. We're going to be cutting it pretty close, but if we can kill Donu on this turn, which seems pretty much guaranteed. So shrug, Master of Strategy, Finesse, Rage, Battle Trance. Unfortunate. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's not that bad. Uh, do we have the kill? We totally have the kill. Yeah, 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 yeah. We 100% have the kill. Cool. So now, it's a matter of... Uh, Basically, finding a kill on Decca before he kills us, which seems not too terribly difficult. So I'm gonna put the, yeah, the battle trance on top, and then hope that we're not taking 51 here. I don't think we are. It was close. <laughs> it was a very close number. Sweet. Read you the flex. That's incredible. I think this is lethal, actually. Totally is. Woo! <laughs> a little close, but in fairness, he wasn't attacking on that turn, and we still had the Explosive Potion. Uh, it's very possible I could have done that a little bit better, that fight, but I think it ended up being fine. Got a pretty good score as well. I'm not too terribly shocked. Another quick one. <laughs> in the books. Feels good, though. We're actually progressing as Ironclad. Look at that shit. Up to Ascension 13. Can't wait to get to Ascension 15. Can't wait. I really can't. Actually, let me double check. What is Ascension 13? Uh, oh. Poor bosses. That doesn't mean anything to me. <laughs> well, anyway, thank you for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, leave a like, comment, subscribe, do all that good shit, and I'll see you guys back in the next one. This is just a quick reminder, by the way, that um, I will hopefully be streaming quite a bit of Path of Exile this week-ish. Uh, I'm probably streaming quite a bit today. Probably streamed some amount yesterday. Probably will stream quite a bit tomorrow. Um, and then I'll try it throughout the week. But uh, yeah, Path of Exile, new league coming out called Incursion. I'm pretty amped for it. I'm probably going to be streaming that a lot. If you want to watch that 
as well as I do have a link to my stream down in the description, as well as my Twitter if you want to follow me on Twitter for uh, pretty much garbage and then reminders when these videos go up. So, uh, yeah, with all that being said, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later.